Hello, I'm Pastor Ed Taylor of Faith and Victory Church here in Greensboro, North Carolina. We just finished another powerful Bible study here at Faith and Victory Church and a wonderful time in the presence of the Lord as we learn uh, about the things of God. I want to take an opportunity here to share with you something that's very uh, strong in our hearts and very important to us. We've begun a financial campaign referred to as FVC Revive. That's found on GoFundMe. And what we're asking people to do is to go to the GoFundMe site, backslash FVC Revive, and um, check it out, see what's going on with us. We've been in Greensboro for now for a number of years. God's used us mightily. We've had miracles, signs, wonders, people healed, saved, uh, good things, gone all over the world to preach the gospel, use our television ministry, reach all kinds of nations, including uh, uh, communist China. We go in there on a regular basis with our, our, our broadcast. And the past few years, we've just taken kind of a, a little bit of a, uh, well, not a little bit, a pretty big hit financially. And what we're doing is asking you to consider supporting us, paying off all the debt that we've accrued over the past few years and uh, giving us capital uh, flow, cash flow, so that we can do more of the things that are really in our heart to do. Uh, missions trips, reaching out to our community uh, that have been limited uh, as of the past couple of years, and, and just getting us in a better position financially. Um, we're, we're not asking one person to do it all. We're just asking all those that are watching this maybe to consider that, uh, think about it, See if it would be a good thing to you. Just, you just want to do it because it's, it seems good to you. And uh, we would be really blessed if you would and you did. We know that if everybody watches our broadcast would give, a, you know, like $100, uh, we would be out of debt just, just, from the, just one time. Never, never again. Ne wouldn't have to do it ever again. Just a one-time gift by all those who watch our broadcast would completely er eliminate our debt with one swipe and uh, put us in a better position to do what God's called us to. You know, um, some people may say, well, that's not faith to present a need. Yet the Apostle Paul wrote into the church that said, you sent once and again under my necessity. He also uh, was out taking up collections for the church at Jerusalem. Even to one church he wrote and said, look, I'm sending, some guy, I'm, I'm sending the guys in there to strong arm you because if you don't have it ready when they get there everybody's going to be embarrassed so I, now he said it real in the king james he said it real sweet but in actuality he was letting them know i expect you to have the money ready so we have to let people know what's going on we have a specific call here and uh god uses we haven't fulfilled our call we haven't finished our call we want to and so we're looking forward to seeing this um, this campaign go forward. We're looking forward to seeing the money come in and us paying off all the debt and then putting money in the bank so that we can do uh, things that God has for us to do. Pay off our camera equipment, uh, go on missions trips, have the capital flow to advertise and let people know that we're here, to do outreaches in the community and, and to do different things. There's so many things that we desire to do that we need to be in the financial position to do. So I appreciate you taking this, uh, these few minutes to listen to this. I appreciate you um, at least considering it. If you don't, well, you want to, that's fine. Uh, maybe God will speak to someone else or someone else will put it in the heart, and that's okay. We don't have you feel any pressure at all. But here's the, here's the need. We have the opportunity to uh, uh, all over the world get involved here. So if it's on your heart to do that and it seems good to you, we appreciate it. But we bless you anyway. Whether you give or don't give, we just speak blessing over you and trust that we'll be able to continue to come to your homes and to your businesses or wherever you are watching our broadcast and be able to minister life to you from the Word of God. We speak blessings over you, and thank you for uh, taking this time. In Jesus' name, God bless you.